For all your embroidery and digitizing needs, call Bees Embroidery. We would like to have a standalone, low-cost spay and neuter clinic. There is a community grant out there that we have applied for, and we're waiting to see if we're eligible or be approved. Sun Willow is closed, so the doctor from Sun Willow, Dr. McCorkle, is now at Camp Canehunt. They are coming out every once in a while, but it would be nice for people to get these low-cost spay and neuters all the time. Absolutely. Absolutely. This is part of the block grant for the county commissioners, and there were some presentations um, during a county commissioner meeting. How's it looking right now? I, no idea. Yeah. Absolutely. Everything is, we, we thought we did a wonderful presentation, but we'll see. How much money were you looking for? $195,000. So right now you're going to be having your grand opening there at uh, Wilson and East. East Street, at least for your offices, maybe that will continue to grow if we can get some donations? Absolutely. Or Absolutely. even this block grant. <laughs> the block <laughs> grant would be true. <laughs> All right. So donations once again for Tales and I Count. Facebook um, goes directly into our account, um, our website. Um, check. Money order. Money order, mail. What's the phone number? 702-306-3245. And tell everybody about that grand opening once again, what time and date that is. That's going to be November 2nd and 3rd. We'll have the grand opening starting at 8 a.m. Nobody gets up any earlier than that. Mm -hmm. And um, Saturday will be from 7 to 5. All right, perfect. And if you'd like to donate any items for that uh, grand opening, there's also going to be a garage sale and you're looking for items. People can bring their checkbooks and just donate right to you. Absolutely. Cash is great, too.